All right, this is DJ Ethics. We're about to take the old air intake out and uh, clean the throttle body. First thing you want to do is take out three screws, one here, one right there, and mine's gone, but there's one down in there. So uh, the next thing we're going to do, it's already unhooked here, but the uh, sensor, you got to pop this little gray thing out and then slide it out, loosen up this bolt, pull that off of there. Now you can take this out. All right, now we're going to start removing the resonator. That tube pulls right out. And we got a 10 millimeter socket. We're going to move that with. All right, we're going to loosen up this screw right here on the throttle body. We're going to remove both of these nuts. I already took out this one. Take out this one. You can take the whole resonator off. Let's see, clamper. Now I'm gonna take off the throttle body and clean it. I'm gonna take these four bolts off the throttle body first and then get that clip. That clip in there pops down and then it slid right off. Okay, now I'm going to put the resonator back on. When you put the resonator on, make sure that that tube lines up with that hole. Okay, now I'm going to put these two bolts back in the side of the resonator. Make sure you put the ones with the washer on the side and not on the throttle body. They're the same size, but the ones on the side of the resonator have a washer like this. All right, get these down tight. And then clip this back there. All right, the Volant intake tube. I already got the rubber grommet attached with the small end toward the resonator and the uh, two clamps. Let me go ahead and put it in. You kinda gotta slide it over pull it out a little bit and slide it over and then tighten it down. Okay, the filter was kind of hard to get on there. Ended up having to put my chest, pull it up a little bit, put my chest on it right here and push it on and then kind of wiggle this part here to get it all adjusted in there right. But it's in there now. I'm gonna go ahead and tighten those and this down. The cover just sits down in there on top of the filter and the water tank. Just line those four or three holes up. One thing kind of cool, this magnetic bolt holder and this uh, pickup magnet. It's a good thing I had it because I dropped one of the bolts down in there. Another thing this thing's rad for is this one in the corner down here. It's really hard to get to. Everything, the washer, nut magnets to it. You can just stick it down in there and get it started. Alright, that's it. Volant intake. Just tighten these up. And that's it.